Hey everyone, welcome back. We are 9 July 2022. Crypto is holding and I want to talk about this Voyager stuff and all these exchanges today. Uh, basically stopping trading, uh, withdrawals, etc. Let's get into that in a second. But first folks, we have to look at the markets because it's always fun to watch the numbers go up and the numbers go down. But we are up the last seven days on the old Bitcoin, the king of crypto, crypto, not BitConnect, crypto, um, the king of crypto, the digital gold, the digital real estate, the store of value. Yeah, considering that, guys, people knock crypto for being down. It has been volatile, volatile from the start by nature. Equities now are down as well. So I don't want to hear people just saying it's crypto, crypto. Come on. Equity stocks are way down. Uh, Tesla stock, stuff like that. NVIDIA, of course, is way down. Uh, those idiots at NVIDIA, I am a shareholder for full disclosure. The idiots running NVIDIA don't know what the hell they're doing. They should have been marketing directly uh, a product line to crypto miners. But there's something up the guy's butt at NVIDIA. And as a stockholder, I'm a little irked that he doesn't focus at the time when uh, crypto mining was hot, uh, profitable. He didn't focus his line of GPUs for the uh, crypto mining market. Both waste of time on the gamer stuff, man. Gamers buy one or two cards, man. Crypto miners are buying many cards. And he puts in that stupid, and Vidi puts in that crappy LHR low hash rate lock rate bull crap. And then someone has to hack it, and then they uh, sell it to uh, nice hash, LOL miner, NB miner, T Rex miner, blah, 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 G miner, whatever, blah, 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 blah. And then, of course, we got this ongoing bs ethereum merge pos crap going on it's all it's all total shit show folks um that's the nature of crypto i'm not knocking it i'm just letting you guys know the truth because a lot of stupid youtube channels don't give you the truth of how real how real how the reality of all this crap works it's a tough wild west right now and over this whole thing you have the uh regulators the government which may be a good thing to come in and regulate this stuff and having said that We'll dovetail into the uh, the point of this dumb video. Uh, Ethereum at 1200 holding, Bitcoin holding. I think it's going to drop off, guys. Knowing the pattern of the Bitcoin since 2013, uh, we're kind of holding at this shelf, but I think it's going to go down to maybe 16K and Ethereum probably like 600K. That's my guess. Uh, Ethereum goes to POS. I think it's going to just go out because people aren't going to want to care about Ethereum anymore. Miners support Ethereum right now. Even electricity has gone through the roof of at least 70% increase. I don't know why people aren't talking about that. In most states, natural gas prices have gone up. Electric companies have passed that on to the consumers. Uh, I went from 11 cents per kilowatt hour up 7 cents. So I'm at 18, 19 cents or so. Per kilowatt hour, roughly a 68%, 68% increase. So not only is gasoline killing us, the Democrats who are ruining this country are also raising natural gas prices. Uh, we are under attack from within, and it's not good, guys. It's not good at all. We need we need to correct this course, correct it fast. So anyway, that's where we're at in the crypto world, the equities world. And the reality is that, man, you can deny it, you can deny it, you can deny it. Um, but let's just get into it, man. Don't listen to YouTubers. Don't listen to me. I'm just more of the skeptical realist, skeptical realist guy. I just see how the things are. I see these other tubers. Good for them. They have their shtick. They're selling ASICs. They're pushing ASICs. They're pushing uh, exchanges for God knows why. And uh, this is why we're going to talk about this. All right, Voyager. I was a Voyager fanboy. Why was I a Voyager and uh, BlockFi fanboy? Because they were paying interest on the crypto you held. You were getting kind of dividends, if you will, every month for the amount of crypto you held. Then I noticed a trend. Uh, probably end of December, January, BlockFi limited the interest they were paying on their crypto, like Bitcoin. Only up to a certain point in Bitcoin would they pay the nice 4% or 5%. Anything over that, they wouldn't pay that extra. So I'm thinking, what is up with that? So I said, F off BlockFi, I'll hold your credit card, I'll hold the Visa, blah, 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 I get the rewards. Ripped all my crypto off that exchange, made a few hundred bucks, right? From them, moved it over to Voyager, which didn't pull any of the crap at the time. Uh, moved it over there, Voyager was giving just as good as rates. And then lo and behold, for Ethereum, Bitcoin, uh, what's that other crappy one? Litecoin, BAT, basic attention token. 
Dogecoin. Arf, arf, arf. Dogecoin, baby. Uh, Dogecoin to the moon, and it's what? Freaking six cents. Um, as we speak. So these, these little bastards of Voyager were given interest as well. And I made, again, for the past six months, I was making decent interest. Then we saw a pattern. Crypto started to crash. First, equity started to crash. Crypto comes obviously obviously down from its all-time high, 69K, in the 30s and hovers and hovers and hovers. Like now it's hovering at 21. It's going to drop, guys, to 15K. You know it's coming. Um, but again, I'm just holding. I'm holding. And here's what I'm holding. The point of this video is not your coins. Not I said it all wrong. I'm an idiot. <laughs> not your keys, not your coins. If you have your crypto, I'm sure you guys learned too late. This video is often late. But I have been saying in my earlier videos for the past month, get your crap off these exchanges, off these lending platforms. Get them off BlockFi. Get them off Voyager. Get them off Coinbase. Get them off KuCoin, Binance. Uh, what else is out there? A whole crap load. Crypto.com. Get your crap off these platforms because what happened? We had, uh, oh, what the hell was the one? I totally forgot. Lou or something. The one that tanked, uh, the one crypto that tanked. I forgot. I'm such an idiot. I didn't research the video. But first, that goes to zero, right? From 300 down to zero, everybody loses everything. They de Luna. Luna, I remembered. They delisted off exchanges. and Total shit show. People lost a lot of money. That was the first, the first, uh, first thing to drop. Second one was Celsius. Uh, the guy was a shady dude, I think he will say, running this thing. Uh, overextended themselves, couldn't cover it, and then they stopped and blocked withdrawals of your crypto. You don't own the uh, the keys. You don't own those coins. They do. And probably in a small print, it says you to you assume all risk. You could have $100,000 in Bitcoin. Guess what? That schmuck at, uh, at uh, what the hell was it called now? Um, Celsius now has your crypto. It's amazing how the world works, right? Uh, so now we uh, dovetail us now that was early on. So I start seeing a trend. I'm going, man, I, I like getting dividends, but why would I risk something I believe in Bitcoin? Not Ethereum. I do not believe in Ethereum one bit. I used it to mine. It was a, a, an end to a means to get me more Bitcoin. I mined Ethereum as much as I could to get it out in Bitcoin. I hate Ethereum. I hate the developers, hate the platform. I watch their uh, developer videos and I want to just scream. These guys have no leadership. There's no Alpha Chad. There's no Steve Jobs in the front office guiding this ship. And there's obviously no Wozniak behind the scenes doing the uh, the tech, the, 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 the um, state of the art stuff to make this thing solid. It's going to go to zero. I don't like Ethereum at all. I mean, that's just my opinion. Um, if you guys think this is financial advice and you're listening to the wrong channel, nothing on YouTube should ever be financial advice for the love of God. Do your own research. Use your own brain to think this stuff out. So having said that, I did think it out. I saw the pattern. Luna, zero, boom. Celsius, boom, freezing accounts. You cannot withdraw your crap. You lost your coins pretty much. Uh, Bitcoin earlier on, limiting how much interest they're paying. What, what does this mean? These platforms overextended themselves and did not know how to manage it with your money. Uh, a risky, risky, risky proposition. That is why I think government regulation may be a good thing. So here we go. Let's get into Voyager. I don't know, man. We're already freaking eight minutes into this crappy video. All right, there's the prices, blah, blah, blah. Who cares anymore? I'm not even mining, man. It's nice and quiet and cool in my room because my damn electricity bill, like I said, went up 68%. is not worth it to even turn on a CPU. This is a, this is a total shit show, folks, uh, for me. And I'm just being honest. Uh, this is just, just speaking truth. Oh, man, where is this stupid article? I got an email, not an article. Let me find it. Oh, my God. Here it is. This came from Voyager to all its people. So I noticed a trend, again, with Luna, Celsius, and all this crap. I did have a lot of crypto on there making interest. I was risking it. Oh, my God, did I dodge a bullet with Voyager. I pulled everything off. All, everything down to my wallet, my keys, my coins, baby. And uh, it's in cold storage, nice and refrigerated in a vault somewhere buried under, uh, uh, what was that? Cheyenne Mountain next to NORAD. That's where my stuff is buried. My crypto uh, nano ledger, whatever. Uh, I got it off, man. But I did do one stupid thing. I was mining Ethereum. Yet, I was just trying to see if the, if the damn difficulty bomb stopped. So I mined about 25 bucks of Ethereum. Then I was getting paid out my interest for June in Voyager, which came to another, say, 50 or 30, nah, about 30 bucks. So right now in Voyager, I have 
about 50 bucks sitting there worth of crypto. And you, lo and behold, I can't get the crap off because of this letter. They began restructuring process aimed at strengthening Voyager digital financial position. Uh, they did declare a chapter file, a chapter 11 protection. All that means is that they're not going on business. That's supposedly it allows them to restructure their debt. And uh, but to me, I think they're done. And I'm probably going to eat my 50 bucks. I should have known better, but I got off thousands of bucks, man. I sensed it. This is why I tell you fools out there, do your own research. Don't listen to any YouTube idiot. Uh, do your gut. Listen to your gut. Eat clean food because your you your gut tells your intuition how to act. Listen to your gut, not your brain. Listen to your gut. If you're eating junk all day, McDonald's crap, sodas, man, it just messes with your internal gut that gives you that intuition. I was just going, I'm getting the shit out of um, Voyager. Pulled it all down. Luckily, the ball code, again, the 50 was passive income in a way 20 bucks from the mining big whoop right uh and of course like i said the dividend the interest the rewards earned for june while i still had a balance uh now i can't even get 50 bucks out i can't even sell it and i can't even withdraw it it says this feature has been disabled that is freaking scary it's almost like canada when they illegally see uh froze people's bank bank accounts for wrong thing it's the same thing you take this risk with these platforms you are you are, i've learned my lesson and i actually regret recommending them because i did get into the fanboy of voyager liking that you're getting actually dividend passive income on your crypto but if you don't own that crap you see what happens you lose it these guys i think i'll my 50 bucks is gone i think people that didn't uh see the signs of the times didn't get the crypto out uh yeah they're they're uh they're pooping themselves right now and they say right here, this this does not mean Voyager is going out of business. Bullshit, uh, which is exactly what we intend to do. Whatever. Uh, they want to re yeah, they want to reorganize their debt, their financial obligations. They overextended themselves. These guys are new to this game, and they have been swatted. Man, they have destroyed by by the market. They have. Uh, if anything, if they do survive, they will learn and maybe come back stronger. This may be a good thing. It's like they got smacked down. And they can either stay down and call it quits or get back up on their feet and continue fighting. I don't know. Depends how much uh, they over leverage themselves with our money. <laughs> Gotta love it, man. Oh, my God. Uh, let's see. The Voyager was created the idea that investors deserve a platform where you can lose all your crypto due to mismanagement and over leveraging of the Voyager company. We will strongly believe in his future, the prolonged volatility and contagion in their. I can't read anymore. You get the point. It's all BS. Uh, when they sign a letter like this, if they really meant it, why wouldn't they give you like a week notice to pull your crap off? They just pulled the rug right out from most people. Even me, 50 bucks is 50 bucks, man. A lot of people do a lot of strange things for 50 bucks. Uh, I just think it's really interesting. I'm actually dodged a freaking bullet, man. Got that stuff off, got it down to my uh, my keys, my coins. That should be a t-shirt. And then you should have pictures of... Um, Celsius, Luna, uh, BlockFi, Voyager, and with a little stop sign over them, don't go there, and like a big ledger smile, go here, my keys, my coins, my keys, my coins, I guess you can march somewhere and say that, my keys, my coins, my keys, my coins, all right, guys, that is all I want to say, oh, I don't like this, given the confidence you placed in Voyager, we are still going to like BF you and uh, take your money to pay off our debt, it, it, may, it may be disconcerting news. Yeah, if you were really men about it and alpha chads and honorable, you would have let people get their money out. Uh, again, there was a you know they were afraid there'd be a run on their bank and they'd be totally out of luck. But too bad that's the game you entered and play. But they they screwed their customers big time. Uh, we made these decisions specifically to protect and maximize the value of the assets on the platform for all stakeholders, including you, our customers who remain our bull crap. They got your money and it's gone. My 50 bucket gone. I ain't going to see 50. I ain't going to see that 50 again. That 50 gone. Voyager's probably out at Las Vegas running that 50 through the slot machine right now. Who knows? Anyway, I think it's sad. I'm glad, man. That's why you got to look and watch this crap every day, this crypto. If it's not for you, if you're faint of heart, I'd put it in a nice, stable, not even a state, just the index 500 fund. Just put it in that. Those things outbeat most financial advisors, those idiots who think they know how to pick stocks for you, and then they charge you a fee based on your earnings. They're idiots. Stay away from all financial advisors. Ameriprise, um, Fidelity, Vanguard, 
uh, all those fools, man, you better, my advice, that is my advice. Stay away from those fools. You have two eyes, two ears and a brain, read your own, do your own reading, figure out what works for you. Start small. But, uh, if this crypto crypto experience is too much for you, get out of the game. But right now with Voyager, it's too late. They, they have your money and, uh, yeah, they're going to be a taillight policy. You're going to soon see that app on your phone, Voyager and nothing's working. Can't connect. Can't connect. <laughs> oh my god it's almost as bad when i was an idiot and i gave 50 bucks to that horrible person john mccain that traitor of america and i gave him 50 bucks that traitor and uh to his stupid campaign in what or 2001 or whatever he ran i don't care i was stupid never do that again i hate politics i don't know why i did that anyway on that horrible note uh not your coins not your crypto hasta la vista baby